All right, today we want to talk about are you progressing in your business? So, progress, profit. That's what we got. Leaves. Bunch of leaves we got to get rid of, guys. And jobs like this just come on a regular now. With me being uh, on Google, my Google really active. So, we're going to clean all this up. Let's shut this. Get no leaves off in here. Shut it best we can. There we go. So you want to progress. We want to get all these leaves moved. And they're going to go out the back. Uh, if we can get out the back. Let's see. And come out the back and you got leaves everywhere right here. What we got, you gotta take care of this. So, we're gonna pull out the Red Max. We're gonna get it done. And progress, are you progressing your business? How's the profit been? Yeah, one thing I noticed, uh, cutting back on all payments. I may pay for more. As far as trucks, guys, we'll get into it. You can find some pretty used good trucks for a nice price. So, let's get this thing cleaned up get it knocked out and we'll talk about are you progressing in your business start smoking all right now let's talk about progressing in your business first let's start with customers leaf jobs i didn't have them at first not at all and the reason why i didn't have them in my business is because i didn't have the mindset of i'm going to be removing leaves all my mindset was on was I'm gonna mow, trim, and blow. That's it. That's how I came into the game. I came into the game just wanting to be a cutting guy, mowing guy, taking care of people who really couldn't afford to be able to have lawn service. That was my thinking. But as time changed, things changed. And I'm in a whole different direction. I come to find out that in my service, I can keep some of my customers, but a lot of people really can't keep up, keep up with me in my business. So, and I'm not saying that like, I can't take on the smaller yards and the $20 yards. Well, I am gonna say that I won't take on the $20 yards. That's where I started at, 20s and 25s. Guys, my minimum price now has went up to $50. And people could call it greed, they could say whatever, but I'm bringing value. When I get done with the yard, guarantee they're gonna say, yeah, it's worth it. Next thing in your business, are you progress as far as equipment? I remember when I started, all I had was my truck. I had a five by 10 trailer, 48 inch more, 21 inch push more. There was a, uh, I can't even remember if it was a craftsman guy. It might've been a craftsman. Craft, craftsman push more that's what it might have been i started with that and uh i had a little husqvarna bt 150 blower if you know anything about that blower it's like you don't want to do one of these leaf jobs with that blower trust me it's for really sidewalks and curves i started with that but i knew that i was going to start taking on yards so all the money i started getting i started reinvesting back into the business and as I started reinvesting back into the business and buying bigger equipment and stuff, I started actually getting customers where that new equipment was going to have to be used on that yard. So I started there and as I started getting it, I just started building more and more equipment, start stacking more and more equipment. And uh, I also started, I wasn't filming video. I wasn't doing YouTube. I wasn't doing Instagram, none of that. I bought me a camera maybe two years after being in the business. And that's part of my journey also. By me investing in a camera, now I get companies to reach out to me who want to give me equipment to test out. So always upgrade. Are you progressing in your business? Next thing I say is very, very important. Getting rid of negative people. Are you getting rid of any and everybody 
who aren't on your journey. You have to. It's a must. Those things will hold you back. They will hold you back. Negative people and trying to get negative people out of your life should be top priority. You need to build a team that wants to be going the direction that you're trying to go. And that's what I got on and that's what I'm on moving forward. And you see this right here, that little yellow thing I just hooked up is called the ant. And I'll have to do a better video. I believe this tarp was too heavy for it. But if you go watch my Equip Expo video, I had a guy that I met. He has this product. It's his product. And it works great. It may be just I had too much of a load. So, guys, you have to get rid of negative people. That's another upgrade. And I believe if you do those three, those three can help you get the money you want. All right, so finally getting the last load up, man, and tarp loaded up, made an old leaf burrito, ready to get out of here. We'll go around his back and show you how this back looks now that we got it knocked out. And are you making progress in your business, man? Like every week, every day, every month, every year, you should be able to see progress. So that's what the back looks like now. Got all of it cleaned up. Looking good. He actually came out and told me he was satisfied. And I'm going to send him a link to leave me another Google review. So we can add another review to the Google. So let's open up the back, show you what the back look like. Now I have to do some before and after pics. I'll drop them and I'll show you guys what it look like. And uh, basically what we got done. So I think it looks pretty good. You guys let me know, drop a comment. So, what you're growing in your business, are you hiring yet? Are you still solo? How you gonna run it? And I just feel like you run it how you wanna run it. The bigger it is, the more headache it is in my experience and what I've been learning. The more you grow, the more the business is gonna require you. So, you're gonna be working. So you can say you wanna be big, 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 and you're gonna be working big, 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 big too. So just think about it, something to think about. So guys, I'm out of here. Another leaf job down for the spring. This is a customer I have not mowed. All they wanted was the leaves done and we knocked them out. So, Boneyard Lawn Service, I'm out of here.